and we just get thrown into our match. Water, Fairy and Darkness. So Fairy with Keldeo and something else. Oh look at all the magma gear. Must have won a tournament. I will go first. It's always scary when you see all this magma stuff. It means they are winners. Okay, so no basics. And now we do have a basic. But no energy. So I guess we're gonna have to Skylar for Professor's Letter. Oh no, it's Seismitoad. Fairy. Oh no. Hmm. Well, we'll put Evil Tall down. Uh, yeah, we'll Skylar. Because we need energy. And now we take some. Looks like there's quite a lot in our deck, so no prized energy. Attached to the Murkrow. I'm considering Hypnotoxic Verbank. Because I don't think he's the sort of Pokemon that's going to retreat anytime soon. So giving him 60 damage before we get to my turn, that might be nice. Maybe I want to save the Hypnotoxic for a Nightmare Mambo later. Hmm. I think we'll do it. Yeah, we'll do it. No, he didn't sleep though. Uh, tempted to Ultra Ball. Just because we might get shut off soon. But there's nothing I could. If I reduced my hand size, he would be less likely to end, which I could really do with. So I'll end the turn and hope that he uses an end, seeing I still have four cards rather than one. Band club, so Spritzy again, I presume, and another Pokemon. No, oh, no, Malamar and Evoltal. This is an interesting deck. Yep. But no double colors, so we'll be fine there. Oh, and there goes the Burbank. Okay. At least we're awake. We'll evolve now. But I don't think we have enough. No, we don't have enough energy to Nightmare Mambo. But I think I'll still attach. And we'll put the other Murkrow down. And just a Hypnoblast. It might be a really good attack if he stays asleep. Yeah, because that would shut off Quaking Punch if he ever used it. If he stays asleep and we draw an energy, we can knock him out next turn, actually. Get a quick two prizes. Oh, Darkness and Fairy Energy. Well, got a power up evil tell, I suppose. Yeah, Evil Talk can't attack with just fairies. Looks like he's playing his hand down, probably for an N or a Ju Juniper soon. Because I don't think we've seen a support at this turn. Nope, he hasn't played a support at this turn. Just attaches to Malamar. Uh, 
Oh, I wake up. Oh, and he doesn't. If I get an energy here. Ah. Oh. Ah, oh, well. We can still evolve and just hypnoblast, but that's an opportunity missed. Yeah, that's a missed opportunity there. <laughs> this seismitoad likes to sleep. Whether he's asleep or not next turn, an energy will knock him out. Unless he has a switch or something. Ah. And he's awake now. <laughs> All right, a fan club. That's good. Don't need the ultra balls anymore, really. Now. Grab evil tall and baby evil tall. And play them both down. Need more energy. It's, it's weird. Last game we only had energy, and now there are now there's none. I don't know where it's gone. There's still four double colors. I think six, seven darkness. But I have no idea where it is. Now he does have the opportunity to retreat if he wants. Into Evil Tall. And I think knock out Honchkrow. Yeah. Which would get rid of all of my energy in play. So he's got. He's got the priority here. He could easily take a really dominating lead here. Which it looks like he is going to do. Yep. That knocks me out. We need more energy. <laughs> oh, a chorus. That's fantastic. Six cards at last. I'm wondering if he's struggling for cards because he hasn't played a supporter. No energy, really. Really. Alright. Don't think we're going to need the spirit tomb here. Um, Burbank Hypnotoxic, maybe, but he can just retreat out of it. And then Quaking Punch which I don't really want. So I guess I'll save it. But I could put the Burbank down to trap him. Which would leave him... He'd do 80 damage. I think we'll just trap him. Stop him retreating. But we're not going to Hypnotoxic. And yeah, we'll just end the turn. No attachment, which is awful. He's only got four cards, though. And they don't appear to be great ones. Oh, that's not good. That's really not good. Why Cyclone moving the energy back? But he can just put it back there. Alright, so I think now we don't have much of a choice. We have to Hypnotoxic and hope that he stays asleep and won't attack me. Please sleep. Oh dear. Alright, we'll play the Spirit Tomb so that we can versus Seeker for a chorus and get an extra card back. Uh, do I want to play the Muscle Band anywhere? Maybe on the Honchkrow or an Evil Tom? I think we'll play it on Honchkrow. That might, you know, 
that might come in very useful. Or it might not. Ah, look, energy. So, we'll put one on, I think, Evil Tall first. So we can start pulling energy out. And power up a Hunchcrow. Oh, we have a switch. I just noticed we can switch. That's nice. We can save Evil Tall EX. Eventually, because it's being slow. Maybe should have attached the muscle band there. And start finally doing what this deck should. Which is powering up Punch Grow for a Nightmare Mambo. But I think we've already used some Hypnotoxics. Uh, yeah, two. So that's half of our sleep power gone. And he's got the ability to retreat back. Oh no, there goes the muscle fan. And he finally found an N. So he's gonna have a hundred. Gonna have a hundred hit points left. So I don't think I'll be able to knock him out. Oh, and here comes the seismic toad for a quaking punch. Bye bye items. He's not getting as much energy as he'd like, I think. Oh, and we stay asleep. Oh dear. So, that's a wasted turn, really. For me. I can't muscle band. I don't think we'll play an N. I don't think his hand's that great. Can't switch out of the sleep. Yeah, I think we'll just leave it as that. Tempted to chorus, because he is going to keep quaking punching. But not this turn. When we have a powered up punch ground, then we might. But if we don't start playing slightly aggressive soon, then it's going to be over. Another spritzy. Oh, he has a chorus of his own. That's nasty. Oh, he runs bear tick. That must be for the lesser spotted uh, can't remember what you call it now. It's so rare now. With its intimidating mane. Pyro, that's it. Yeah. You don't see those anymore. Not since Quaking Punch. Oh, again. Okay, well. Evil Toss stuck there now. But we do have a powered up Punch Grow, which is nice. Uh, is there anything I could Skylar for? I guess I could get a Hypnotoxic, but we can do that next turn. We'll just Chorus for 9, I think. Yeah. Uh, we have a Verbank, but I don't think there's much use using that. So we'll end the turn. Darkness and Double Colorless for the damaged Evil Tor, so... Could be worse. Doesn't matter that I stay asleep because I do get knocked out. I'm actually thinking do I promote the Haunt Grow and start playing with that? Or do I just promote Baby Evil Toll? Get some more energy onto our damaged Evil Toll EX? That's a hard decision. I also have a Lysander, so I could pull out an EX and get rid of it, but I'm not sure which one I would choose. Oh, and everything gets end away anyway, okay. Still have a Hypnotoxic though, which is nice. Yeah, and there's the Bertic. 
That was the water Pokemon then, not Keldeo. Oh, and Seismitoad, obviously. Keldeo is really popular again. I think it sort of went away, but now it's back. Oh, that's a curious switch. For each... what? 20 more for each retreat cost. So that would only do 40 to hunt grow. Which isn't bad. 130 HP though. And I'd only be doing 120. So unless I can find a muscle band, I'm about to get knocked out. Ha! <laughs> Alright, we'll top deck a muscle band then. But he's probably going to just knock me out next turn anyway. So I guess we'll start powering up Baby Evil Tall. Which will power up Big Evil Tall. Alright, we need to get the sleep. Need to get the sleep. No! No! Oh, we have not had good luck here. <sighs> Could get a chorus. Don't know what good that would do. Because we need that double colors, I guess. I could Nightmare Mambo and just really hope. I think that's probably going to be my best bet. I don't need a muscle band yet. But if we do 60, 80, and he's taking. Oh no, we might. If we muscle band here and do 40, we'll be on 80 for next turn and we can knock him out if he doesn't retreat. But he would retreat. He would retreat. Little coward. We'll do 60. <laughs> yeah, I think Vertic's probably going now. Evil Tall will sort me out. Oh, I've been put to sleep just for good measure. That's why I need Malamari X. It saves all this hypnotoxic rubbish. Yep. Bye bye. That was a waste of a sleep, but never mind. Yeah, 140 damage. Nice. 2040. Yeah, I don't mind because he can just transfer everything over. I die anyway. <laughs> uh, to muscle band now or later? I think now. Do 50, leaving with 120. Sounds like a nicer number to me. We'll play that down. I think we'll call us this turn with the versus seeker. Yeah, we'll just call us. Which will be a lot of cards. Whether we can do anything with them, though. We get another haunch grow, just in case. Uh, we'll save the muscle band. Might need that later. And just oblivion wing. And we'll attach it to Evil Tall. So Evil Tall's ready now. So it's got 120, so that'd be 20, 40, 60, 80, 120. We're doing 140 damage. So if we did get Evil Tall out, we could take him down. And I think that is his biggest attacker. Is he even going to knock me out here though? 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. 120. I'm still alive. 20, 40, 60, 80, 120. Yep, I live. Yeah, just a retreat. He's going to have to use Maxima. Let's 
So this is going to be risky, but three heads will do it. But does he want to? Because they just walk straight into an evil ball. He might just be walking into an evil ball. If he gets three heads, that is. Two. So I do live. Hmm, now I have choices. <laughs> it's looking vulnerable there. 150, 20, 40, 60, 80, 120, 140. So one more energy. From, oh, but escape rope, that doesn't just switch, does it? No. So I could Oblivion winning it again. Just put 50. But I don't like that my energy is just scattered all over the place. Hmm. This could be a game changing turn. I'm still there, don't worry. Double colors onto Honchgrow, definitely. And I'm tempted just to hit for 50 and power it up. But at the same time. No. I think we're doing right. Do I want to Skylar for anything? I don't think there is anything I particularly need. I do have three Skylars though. Muscle Band maybe, just in case of a Quaking Punch. Yeah, I think we'll Muscle Band Punch Crow. What? What? I wasn't! I was about to play! What is this? Nonsense! That's outrageous. Damn it. 